Uh, we are now being told and have footage sent to me right now by Dr. Rob Lindstead that thousands of Jordanians have flocked to the streets of Amman are, are now in solidarity with the uh, Gaza and the, quote, resistance, as it's being called. So you can see that right next to Israel there, uh, you have Jordan. Very easy for them. Of course, we know that that war took place, which has allowed them to um, uh, get control of the Temple Mount, right? And then we see up there Syria, right there, Syria. We talk a lot about Syria and all the enemies of Israel that are there, Russia and Turkey and Iran. Um, and now we're getting reports that you we see Lebanon, Lebanon to the north. Uh, so now we have rockets coming from Lebanon into northern Israel, opening up a new front. So now Israel is, is, is now fighting uh, off an attack from the north and the south down on Gaza. And yet we now hear of thousands in the streets in Jordan, which would be, uh, if you're looking at a map, to the right of Jerusalem on their side. Aaron, what are the concerns as far as folks flooding over into Jordan to join this battle? I mean, you'd be you're you, you're going to have combat coming from three sides right there. Um, what are your thoughts? We have a very high intelligence, very high security along the Jordan Jordan uh, Valley, the, uh, the 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 Syrian African Rift Valley there, high high security. Um, you know, one of the things that, that has been exposed in this war is we allowed uh, Hamas to sit on our border and we thought that they were behaving themselves. But all along, they were planning, they were watching us, they were strategizing. We're not going to let that happen along the Jordanian border. So if at the moment they get too close, usually... Benjamin Netanyahu and our defense minister, whoever the de defense minister is, they usually give a, a red line, whether it's 10 miles, 20 miles. They've done it in, in, the, uh, in the Golan Heights uh, on the Syrian border. They've said to the Syrians, they've said to the, the, uh, the um, uh, we, we've spoken to the Russians not to allow anyone beyond a certain uh, distance. And we're not going to let that happen along our Jordanian border. We've got enough on our northern border and on our southern border. We don't need another front.